Yeah, I am pumped for this guy. The following contest is a triple threat extreme rules match. Making his way to the ring from North Carolina, weighing in at 218 pounds, Kenny Omega. The feeling, the electricity in the arena right now is unlike anything I've ever felt in quite some time. This match is going to be good. Always walking around with a chip on his shoulder. He's going to use that anger against his opposition. Here comes the architect, Seth Rollins, the self-proclaimed future of WWE. Ready to go and do exactly what he does best. And his opponents, first representing the authority from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, Seth Rollins! Cocky, crafty, conniving, Seth Rollins is one heck of an athlete, but his ego and attitude have obviously eclipsed his otherwise impressive talent. Okay, Cole, crafty? Yeah, you yourself dubbed him the architect, Cole. Conniving? He simply has vision. Cocky? Why wouldn't he be? He's the future of this company, like it or not. Sometimes it can be hard to tell just how good Seth Rollins really is, but he really is capable in the ring. We've seen that before and we'll no doubt see that tonight. Well, I'd say he's more than capable. Rollins believes he's on a whole other level, and it's hard to argue against that. Things are about to get good. And from Huntington Beach, California, weighing in at 282 pounds, Sam O. R. Jones. You know, I know for a fact that there are a number of people in the locker room who dread getting in the ring with this superstar. Well, Byron, every superstar in that locker room is being paid to compete, so spare me the sob story. He's in perhaps the best physical condition of his life. He knows what it takes to reach the top here in WWE. Here we go, Extreme Rules match time. No disqualification, no count out, anything goes. Hashtag Extreme Rules if you want to get in on the conversation. You can tell that each superstar is coming into this match a little extra cautious, a little more nervous because of the uncertainty an Extreme Rules match presents. 
Unbelievable athleticism. Showing off the quickness. That'll turn things around in a hurry. He gets back into the ring. Uh-oh. Reversal. Can he take advantage? Neckbreaker. Trying to debilitate the capability to stand. Oh, kick right to the back. Dropped with a suplex. Ah, look at this. Ooh, right to the arm. He got whipped into that corner. Corner and a couple back elbows to follow. Caught with a neck breaker. Sleeper hold cinched in deep. And breaks out of the sleeper. Boom. How does one best take advantage of the extreme rules environment? Quite simply, if you can dream it, you can do it. This isn't the time to be timid. This is the time to leave it all in the ring. I missed you. I wanted to knee you in the face again. Ridiculous standing shooting star. Agility like that is what can set you apart from the rest of the locker room. Re-entering the ring now. DDT! He's staring his opponent down, getting into that zone. You go up, you have to come down. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Being carried around with ease. Down across the knee, that won't just separate your shoulder, that'll divorce it. Heads out, and he has all the time he wants. And now getting the ladder in place on the ring apron. And don't sleep on how dangerous a spot that is for a ladder. Letting his opponent know he can take on the world right now. Delivered into the barricade. Face buster. Look at this, snap suplex. Has the opposition in the palm of his hand, and he knows it. He's looking for something. This could get dangerous. Look at that insult to injury with that one. There's a special word that I can't say on air for that type of slap. Hey, keep things T for team, Corey. He's burying elbows in the midsection. Placed in the corner. Oh, my God, a clothesline. He's struggling a bit here. Part of the territory when you're in an extreme rules match, Cole. Working the yard and then a kick right to the ribs. Delivering nasty stops. You want to control the tempo, you want to dictate the pace. That right there is how you do it. If Superstar could go all day. You can see that each strike drained their opponent's energy. This is not... Uh-oh! Reigns down an elbow retaliation. Going counter for counter. Now, can it be capitalized on? Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Oh, this match is spilled out to the ringside area. And as we can see, tension's really running high now. Uh, yeah, we should probably clear the way, guys. There it is. The Camaro Plex is complete. Single leg drop kick caught him. Seth Rollins' arrogance on full display with that gesture. Oh, boom! Running STO plants him. Nicely done. Oh, boy. To the announce table now. Oh, uh, yeah. Gonna clean it off here. This is gonna be dangerous. We knew this superstar had a mean streak. We didn't realize that they were downright ruthless. And now gets tossed into the ring. Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. What? No sign of hesitation, and that risk gained big rewards. He went right into that turnbuckle. Oh, what a close line. He's trying to intimidate his opponent one more time, but he's got to strike soon. Fights the shoulder up in one. No time to waste being shocked. You've got to maintain. 
Yokita clutch. Rocked in. He breaks up the hold. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? Look at him now. He realizes he's holding the great equalizer. He'll take things into the ring. Staggering to his feet, but he won't like what's coming next. Look out! Hurricane Unbelievable athleticism. Into a Patella Brainbuster? And he stops the count. Suplex attempt. Able to go behind, though, into a chop block. Inverted atomic drop, incoming, Ooh. big boost. And the centaur to cap it off. Chairman into the ring now. Weapon in hand saying, I'm up in the ante. Big knee to the midsection. Rollins with a head of steam. Big air. He puts a hole on the neck. Rollins just turned the lights out. Here he goes for the win. Got it. No, just a two. Somehow, some way, he is still. What's he open to find down there? Shades of the old EC dub as a kendo stick is introduced to the proceedings. Whack! This is turning into Swanson Street. Can there be frustration mounting in these competitors? No, it's going to take more to win this one. You can't let those feelings seep into your psyche. You have to keep your focus. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. Long way up in the electric chair. Oh, my driver! Can he put this one away? Cover! Two count! Oh, and he just kicked out. I thought for sure this thing was wrapped up. Well, stay in your seat. Looks like we've got a ways to go yet. And the heaviest hitter in the arsenal was not enough. And he wants nothing to do with any of that. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Oh, wow. Things are about to get very interesting and dangerous. Sling blade! Sling blade! Knees up. Knees were up. All the breath taken out of their body with that counter. Getting set up for something in the corner. Kick! Oh. And attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. Up there can leave you dazed. Oh, <laughs> sledgehammer! Cover here! And he fights it off. There's some shock in the arena after that kick out. Sledgehammer right to the gut. Down on the ground, getting pummeled by that hammer. Any one of these attacks could cause irreparable damage, but I don't think you can come back from this. Is up there, pulling up and driven down. Emerald explosion. Warm up the buses. This one's over. Oh, you played for it all the time. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. And close line. Oh, that can rock you. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. from all three superstars in this match.
He is standing tall, standing proud, and standing victorious after that battle, gentlemen, beating one other superstar's no walk in the park, let alone two.